Here are 15 times animals mess with the wrong opponent hash three. Number 15, dog vs. horse. A couple out for a stroll in a wooded area with their dog were possibly not prepared for the company. They got a family of Carpathian boars happened to be in the area at the same time. The boars took offense to this, but the family dog geared up for a good time. The dog and boars ended up in a game of chase. The dog would chase the boars only they end up being chased himself. If the dog chased the baby boar of the family, then mom and dad took chase to protect him. To be honest, it wasn't all that wise for this dog to mess with those boars. It might have ended badly for both the dog and his humans. Human attacks by wild moors are rare, but they can be incredibly serious with their tusks. They can charge at a human and cause horrific injuries around the Thai region. They will then keep charging until the victim is no longer moving. If these dog owners knew this, they would probably have taken a more proactive approach to keep their furry friend away from the boar family before. Now it's time for the star topic. Okay, so what was this lizard thinking? Trying to mess with this many-legged creepy crawly. Given its size compared to the lizard, it was never going to be a fair fight. We think the lizard was feeling particularly peckish and decided the centipede-like critter was worth a go. But it ended in more than tears. What do you think? Do you believe the lizard started it and the insect ended it or that the insect snuck up on the lizard? Number 14 Python, Honey Badger and Jackal It's not very often you see a three-way battle between different species. Still, it probably taught him a thing or two about which animals they seek out for dinner. Rosaline Kerr is not at all confident in that one was on a safari in Botswana's Chobe Park when she caught sight of a honey badger, two jackals, and a python embroiled in a battle. She quickly got out her camera and captured what happened next. Initially, our money was on the python. The honey badger was in grave danger as the python had wrapped its body around the badger. But then the jackals turned up and things took an unusual turn. Yes, one of the jackals got a bit curious about what was happening and the snake was momentarily distracted. It attempted to lunge out at the jackal before going back to trying to sort out this honey badger but that distraction was all it took for the events to play out differently. The honey badger got free and attempted to drag the snake away while the jackal gets in on the action. The second jackal, no one to miss out gets involved and they end up in a tug of war with the snake. Isn't nature wonderful and kind of brutal? Number 13 Penguin Chicks Rescue a snackish petrel bird mess with the wrong animals the day it tried to snatch away a vulnerable baby emperor penguin. The footage of the interaction came courtesy of the BBC show Spy in the Snow, which involved an emperor spy cam being able to capture everyday footage of emperor penguins in their natural environment. The petrel turns up to cause carnage and the young chicks try to flee. Though, as you'll probably know, running isn't exactly a skill that penguins have. One chick slips, and the petrel takes its opportunity to attack. But it wasn't going to be that easy for the petrel. The chicks form a barrier around the vulnerable chick and manage to fend off all its attacks. The petrel's day then goes from bad to worse. As a protective male, a daily penguin turns up and puts itself between the chicks and the predator. The petrel thinks better of it, probably doing some math in its head and realizing he's outnumbered, so he soon leaves the penguins alone and they carry on with their penguin business for the day. Number 12. Dog Chases Black Bear could dogs be any more pure? They love us unconditionally, are always excited to see us, and now they protect us from black bears. In 2019, a New Jersey man uploaded footage of his neighbor's dog, Riley, scaring a black bear away from his property. The nosy bear had turned up to explore, who had resident Mark's Encino's property, which his backyard camera caught on tape. The bear wandered around, pulled down his bird feeder, and attempted to get at the delicious treats inside. He probably didn't intend on being caught in the way he did. Riley's eyeing up the bear from behind some bushes before he leaps out and chases the bear. He gets in a few tackles before the bear runs off the property. Though Riley doesn't give up until the bear is entirely off the property and showing no signs of coming back. Mark said that Riley would definitely be getting a steak dinner the next time he sees him. He also said Riley is an awesome dog who sometimes comes and checks on his kids. Well done, doggo! Number 11. Rhinos teach hippo a lesson. If this doesn't look like interactions with your annoying younger siblings, then we don't know what does. Rhinos and hippos don't typically interact, so it was quite a shock for the head ranger Mike Kirkland of one of the oldest private game reserves in South Africa to see it happening in person. So much so that he decided to capture the entire encounter on video. The hippo was on its own, which Mike believes was because droughts had caused many hippos to leave the area. 
This solo hippo may have been lonely and may be a little curious about the rhino. It saunders up to the rhino in the bushes and checks him out. The rhino does the good big brotherly thing and ignores him. But then the hippo continues to follow him and even tries to nip him on the bottom. As the rhino keeps trying to run away, the hippo carries on after him. Eventually, the rhino gets so fed up that he starts chasing the hippo, even managing to prod him on the bone with his horn. The two other nearby rhinos simply ignore the whole thing, playing out. Number 10. Deadly Snake No Match for Elderly Gentlemen When you come across one of the deadliest snakes in the world and one responsible for the most deaths caused by snake bites in Australia, what do you do? Do you run away, screaming, recoil in fear, call the police? If you're this elderly chap, you give it a couple of kicks to get it off the footpath and carry on your merry way. The deadly eastern Australian brown snake had been lurking around a popular beach spot, climbing concrete walls and edging its way to a food food service area that could spell disaster for anyone who didn't see the snake and quickly move out of the way. As an older man was on his way to the bathroom, he kicked it in the face. The snake, as you can imagine, wasn't impressed. Then he delivered a second kick, which saw the snake move on very quickly. Both the snake and the man were unharmed, but the footage blew up online. It was filmed on a mobile phone and uploaded to YouTube by Joe Tomboy 81 Within days, it had been viewed over 3,500 times. Number 9. Humpback Whale Fans Elf Killer Whales Most mothers would do anything to protect their children. As it turns out, the same rules generally apply in the wild. Off the coast of Western Australia's Ningaloo fisherman Shane Stephen managed to capture incredible drone footage of a humpback whale doing everything in her power to stop a pot of killer whales from taking her calves. The pot of orcas had originally been showing off to the fishermen under the boat. They then caught sight of the two-week-old calf swimming alongside his mom, almost as if they'd been rehearsing. Two of the orcas swam at the mother to distract her while the third attempted to take her baby. The humpback whale fought back very fiercely as only a desperate mother could by rolling around and lashing her tail at the whales. She fought bravely for about two hours, but ultimately the odds were stacked against her when there are three of them and one of you. You are not going to be in the best position. Nature can be cruel after fighting for so long. The orcas did end up with her baby for not crying. You're crying. Number 8. Monkey vs. Cat This kitty cat stands his ground against three monkeys. The monkeys are much bigger than the cat, and when two more monkeys join in, the cat is clearly outnumbered. The monkeys don't attack it. They keep looking at it and ask themselves why the cat doesn't look like them. This overhead view gives us a good look of a scuffle between a cat and a monkey. The video cut short so we don't get to see how it ends. These naughty monkeys drag this poor little kitten around the kitten yows, but it can't do much to defend itself. The monkeys corner the kitten wherever it goes. The poor cat is terrified, but the monkeys don't let up. However, the kitty is gutsy and doesn't let its guard down for one second. These two seem to be friends, but the monkey tries to grab the cat's legs and drag it outside. However, the cat is slightly bigger than our last cat and can fend the monkey off. Nevertheless, these two are buddies and mostly playing with each other. Number 7. Elephant gives buffalo the what for. Elephants may be large, but they are also incredibly playful when the situation calls for it, though they often have to make sure whatever they are playing with isn't on the fun. Otherwise, offense may be caused. In 2013, a nine-year-old boy called Alex Ray took some footage of an elephant's interaction with a buffalo, which was then uploaded to YouTube by the Sabai Sabai Reserve channel. The footage shows an elephant watching a herd of buffaloes. Not content to just watch, it curiously wanders over to them before giving one of them a playful nudge. But that buffalo was either not ready to make new friends or just didn't appreciate the tactic. It proceeds to charge towards the elephant while the elephant saunters away. It made a lot of people laugh when it was originally uploaded, but got a new claim to fame years later. Ifs officer Susan Tananda uploaded the footage again in 2020, plenty of people commented about the likelihood that the elephant was dared by the other elephants to do what it did. Another elephant must have dared this fella to do that for 100 bananas, one person said. Number 6. Attack of the Crows In 2017, Cork Institute of Technology students had more to worry about than just making sure they studied for their exams. They also had to do their best not to be attacked by non-discriminatory but very angry crows. Over a dozen people at the educational facility in Ireland had to receive tetanus shots and antibiotics after they were attacked by crows while minding their own business. Such was the threat that the college officials sent out warnings to people on the campus to take care 
when walking around a particular part of the property. Given that the term was drawing to a close, many people thought the crows were hungry due to a loss of student scraps. Others thought there might have been nests nearby that the crows were trying to protect. The Court Society for the Prevention of Cruelty to Animals visited the campus to determine what's what in the strike zone they found a grounded jack on nestling. Unable to find his nest, the CSBCA took him into foster care. It was likely that the other crows had been protecting their baby by attacking people who got too close. Number 5. Zebra Kicks Wildebeest Many animals in the wild can coexist harmoniously. After all, there are plenty of resources that need to be shared, like watering holes, though some animals might do so begrudgingly, almost as if their parents never taught them to share with their friends. Wildebeest and zebras were grazing an area of land next to a small watering hole. Dust would be kicked up from time to time, but they all seemed to go about their business without anything dramatic happening. But for some unknown reason, a zebra took a general offense to a wildebeest being too close to him. With one kick to the head with his hind leg, he knocked the wildebeest clean out, chaos ensues and all the animals scatter. Not really sure what happened or what was going on, the wildebeest remains on the ground before gaining consciousness. It attempts to get backed up, but struggles. Eventually, all the animals go back to grazing as if nothing has happened. While the down wildebeest is clearly a little bit dazed and confused, the zebra deserves to go into timeout. Number 4. Meerkat vs. Cape Cobra Let's face it, a meerkat is not going to win in a battle against a Cape Cobra. They are incredibly venomous snakes that grow up to around 2 meters long and can even climb trees. If a cobra comes across a meerkat underground, they can even take their babies without much of an issue. So when they have a meerkat in their sights, there's very little hope the meerkat's going to be able to get away or can it. In a meerkat versus cape cobra battle, there are some exceptions to that rule. Meerkat can produce alarm calls kind of like the animal version of calling 911. They'll make a particular call when they see a snake so the rest of the meerkat family can get away. Alternatively, they use a gang approach. They will mob the cobra so that it doesn't stand a chance. This method of defense teaches the young meerkats to look out for the snakes but it also teaches the snakes not to mess with the meerkats. So, who's the deadly one? Now, it's not always the snake. Number 3. House Cat vs. Snake If you were to decide the fastest animal out of a no-protein, a cat, you might go for the snake. They have lightning-fast reflexes, and a take-no-prisoners approach to anything that gets in their way. But what about your average feline friend? They kill birds and mice for fun. So surely they stand a chance against a snake. As it turns out, they do. Someone uploaded footage to the internet of an everyday house cat coming across a snake. At first it stayed back and watched the snake with curiosity, but as you'll likely be aware, cats love to play with string and snakes look like a bit of string, don't they? The cat sidles up to the snake and pats it with its paw before retreating. As the snake attempted to launch an attack on the cat, the game of cat and mouse or cat and snake commences before the cat manages to fling the snake into some grass. As the snake is no longer moving, the cat moves in for a closer look, but it turns out that the snake is just playing games. It latches onto the cat, and the cat takes off running with the snake attached. Number 2. Mongoose vs. Cobra When you look at a cobra and then look at a mongoose, it's pretty obvious who would win in a fight. The mongoose just looks like a defenseless squirt, while a snake is a fearsome warrior that takes no prisoners and saying that the winner may just surprise you. In most situations, all goose will gather its family members to fight off predators together. This gives them a better chance of protecting themselves, though every now and then, a confident lone mongoose will attempt to take on a cobra by themselves. A video produced by the Smithsonian channel shows a single mongoose attempting to battle a deadly cobra all on its own. She fluffs up her tail to make herself look larger and shields her body to stop the snake from being able to get a nibble full of confidence. She uses her sharp teeth to bite the cobra's tail which seems to just annoy it more than anything. Now she's on high alert, and a blade of grass hitting her face knocks her confidence and has her giving the snake some distance. The yellow mongoose sees the battle going on and joins in on the fight. When the first mongoose takes a backseat, the yellow mongoose becomes involved in a showdown that ends with both parties going their separate ways. Number 1. Elephant Seal Crushes Car For some reason, elephant seals aren't content living their best life on beaches and land masses around the southern hemisphere. Instead, they have to ruin people's day by venturing into public areas and annihilating their cars. Male elephant seals can weigh over 4 tons and grow up to around 20 long. 
so they aren't exactly lightweights if they are going to attempt to damage something they generally don't have to try very hard. That has been the case several times over the years, especially in New Zealand. There have been several examples of elephant seals bashing themselves on cars, damaging them to the point of no repair. While their sad, exasperated owners look on, it's not like they can tell the elephant seal to stop. He's clearly got beef with the vehicle and won't take no for an answer. When they aren't crushing cars and terrorizing town folk, they are living in harems of up to 50 females eating fish and devouring the occasional stingray and octopus. Elephant seals also only have two natural predators, orcas and great white sharks. Cars are obviously at the bottom of the food chain. Well, this makes us feel a lot better about our own mistakes. When you make a mistake in the animal kingdom, there tends to be a lot less room for air. Many of these animals prove that. Did any make you wonder why on earth they tried to take on another animal? We can't wait to hear your opinions. Also, check out our other cool stuff showing up on screen right now. See you next time.